Hey guys, Jack Morris here from Man on Fire Films with another episode of Tori Bash Tips where we're back, finally, after the New Year gap and I'm a little bit full of cold so you're going to have to forgive me if I'm a little bit slow, a little bit dumb and kind of tripping over my words but I am rather ill. Now, this is a actually very special episode of Tori Bash because, uh, Tori Bash Tips even because for one, it's the start of season two which is great although it won't be uh, officially on the shows because that makes it kind of complicated for people viewing from the start but whatever, that's neither here nor there. But it's also special because there's not actually going to be an episode here. I, I know, don't panic, I am actually going somewhere with this, please don't hate me. I won't have an episode this week, well there will be, there will be footage, don't worry, but it won't actually be your usual Tory Bash Tips episodes, it probably won't be that educational, more entertaining, but anyway, getting back to it. I actually want to know where you guys want me to take the, season, uh, the show this year, because as far as doing what I wanted to do with Tory Bash Tips, I've pretty much done it. I mean... Yes, I could keep going, giving move tutorials uh, week after week after week, but I'm not sure if that's entirely in the show's best interest, or whether you guys even want me to do that. So I decided, rather than just keep trying with stuff until I find something that you guys like, I would literally just open the floodgates and let you guys comment on this video with what you want me to do with Tari Bash Tips. Do you want me to try and do online stuff, try and get professionals on the show to talk to you instead? Anything. If you have a suggestion, now is the chance to share it. I will read every single comment that's posted on this video, no matter how many. Can't guarantee I'll respond to everyone, but I assure you I will read everyone and take each suggestion on board. So now, to put it simply, the fate of this show is up is in your hands. Up in your hands, I nearly said. Again, I am kind of ill. Uh, so please, 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 please comment on this video with what you want me to do with this show. One option that you might not consider is, Tori Bash Tips as itself can come to a close to be replaced with another Tori Bash show. I am open to that idea. As I said, what I wanted to do with Tori Bash Tips is pretty much done. I feel like I've given people a nice stepping stone for getting into Tori Bash, a nice place to go to learn the basics. But now, I want to know what you guys want me to do with it. So please comment on this video. Now, for this week, because I, I didn't want it, this show to just be a message, but I didn't really have anything else to fill the gap, we're just going to have a very simple kind of let's play of Tori Bash. I'm just going to play for a about 10-15 minutes online against other players, maybe comment as I'm, uh, maybe try and explain what I'm doing, like I did in episode 21 or 22, 20 maybe, 21, I don't know, whatever episode it was where I played online, kind of like that, because you guys kind of seem to enjoy that, I definitely enjoyed that, plus I don't really have a brain to do anything else right now, so we're going to jump into um, uh, quick Aikido, I know it's slightly different to normal Aikido, but I prefer the quicker match, I feel like uh, it's a lot more interesting to watch, so let's jump into this, and uh, always... Oh, wow. Uh, oh, that's not the right guy. Um, okay. Uh, here we go. So, this would be me cutting <laughs> to when I'm actually playing, so... Oh, it is! I was right! Oh, crap! I was unsure whether it was, um... I was unsure whether it was you, dude, because, uh... I'm talking to you directly now, because I know you're watching this. I I'm afraid to say your name. Ceronix. Ceronix. I was... I didn't know it was you, because you usually double X. Welcome to YouTube. I... Yes. Um, so yeah, wow, first time I've ever encountered the fan online, that's awesome. What, what a way to spend the Let's Plays. Um, so yeah, I guess I'm not kidding. Uh, we'll, we'll just uh, we'll jump in as soon as this match is over, which it looks to be soon. Um, num, 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 num. Just waiting for my turn now. Again, my brain is running super duper slow today, so... Me trying to come up with witty commentary or anything to that effect is difficult, hence the, like, ten-second pause when I first joined the game, because my brain couldn't do two things. That's a hell of a flip. Jesus, that's a good flip. Alright, let's do this. Let's fight. Uh, who am I going to be fighting? Looks like I'm going to be fighting... Oh... Uh, oh, I'm fighting... Aiko. Aiko. Aikio. Aikio. Ha, Aikio. It's where karate people shop for their furniture. But I'm... Okay. Okay, I feel I suddenly feel under pressure because there's somebody who actually kind of knows me in this lobby. So don't be a tit, Jack. And uh, people asking if I'm recording. Uh, <laughs> I think this guy assumes this is a private match because that guy addressed me because uh, uh, Cyronix addressed me by name. But I don't care if this guy leaves. Um, uh, let's see. What can I? If I bring that up and bring that down, I can sort of raise him. And there we go. Hold on. Oh, dislocated his arm. I'm gonna totally pretend like I'm meant to do that, and I'm not playing with half brain capacity. Uh, okay, if I contract my elbow, maybe I can bring him in, and I can bring that back around for a nice sneaky jab in the. J oh God, my knee! No, no, no! I'm, uh, can I pull this out? Yeah, I think I think I'll be okay. I think I don't want to jinx it, but I think I'm gonna be okay. Uh, if I, as long as my foot hits the ground before my knee, this is a iffy, iffy. Oh yes, that's what I'm told. All right, we're good. We're back in the game. Okay. 
Uh, if I just bring my arm back up, I can try and flip him like he did to the guy who was versed him before. Give him a taste of medicine. He's grabbed my leg, unfortunately, which is going to make it kind of... Oh, God! Kind of difficult to do anything. Um, oh, no, 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 no. Uh, let's see. What can we do? What can we do? Uh, maybe if, if I don't contract my elbow... Ah, this is it. My hand's going out. Ah, we go. Ah, first game of the match lost, and it was, uh, it was kind of a wing anyway. Uh, oh, well, the replay looks kind of grapply and kind of nice. And I will respond to that. Okay, uh, so I guess we can. I guess this is this can be considered the first time we get to see a fan fighting on the show. Uh, so this is Cironex. Oh, if I'm saying that wrong. I apologize. Fighting. Let's see how this goes. Oh, I guess he'll be fighting his uh, clan mate as well. Uh, this is a <laughs> this is a good day for him, I guess. And uh, hopefully we can see some interesting fights. Um, I don't understand that question. Cool channel, the same as your name. No, no, it's not. I, I, I imagine those two guys are talking, right? They must be. Otherwise, he wouldn't have known who I was. All right. Okay. Uh, whoa, shit. Wow, that really uh, that escalated quickly. Uh, th that's the reason I like Kukakido, especially when I'm filming, is because I don't have to spend so much time waiting for people to take their turns, which, um, I don't know, appeals to me in a recording sense. Uh, so, yeah, don't really have much to say, so I'm just going to you know, sort of dilly-dally and store for time until my brain kicks into gear and I think of something to say. That's a cool trail. Boom. That's a word. Now, seriously, you guys, uh, I got... I've been essentially not at home for bloody ages. Like, I'm talking about a week. So since New Year's Day till last Saturday, I've been either on the road traveling or sleeping uncomfortably, and I've picked up the worst flu, and I'm tired, and everything... Everything hurts, and yeah, it's just it's just a nightmare. But I, I'm determined to put out content, come hell or high water. So you'll have to forgive me if I'm a little, well, a lot scatterbrained, talking for the sake of talking. But when am I not talking for the sake of talking? All right, so we can see an, we can see a clan match of Axis, and uh, yeah, then um, then I guess I'll verse the winner, which I'm gonna have to do a little bit better than I did before. All right, this should be uh, this should be interesting. This should be interesting. like to communicate, you know, make make them make it clear that they they, uh, they should be trying to impress. <laughs> All right, uh, let's let's try and let's try and cross examine what's going on here. So, pause clearly went for a kick. I can't actually I can't tell who's who. I, I'm so I'm always really bad at that telling. No, I guess uh, uh, Cyronix went for a kick and did missed. And pause is going airborne. I guess. Gotta love the uh, double hand grab there. That's basically screwing them, screwing them both a little bit, because that means neither one of them has control over their hands anymore until they both let go. Although they are okay. That's airborne, and his knee, left knee is dislocated. That is gonna bone him later if his legs are near the ground. <laughs> nice, nice touch, nice touch. Uh, oh, oh god, that is an that is a unfortunate leg bend. Holy, holy crap! That is a that is a ball of joints. That right there is a ball of joints. Uh, oh my god, that that is a that that is not a good day to be access uh, pause of pain. No, that is not. I I <laughs> Jesus Christ, there is no way he can get out of that. That was that was um that was quite brutal. That was actually really brutal. Oh God, Jesus. All right, all right. Here's um. Here's me versus Saronix, and I am fighting to impress, I guess. Oh, please don't, please don't hurt me. <laughs> all right, uh, let's bring this around and grab quickly, because I don't have a lot of time. Um, I right, lower my hand now for the grab, bring out the leg, not quite yet for the kick, twist my body into the kick, and hope for the best. Um, not really, I'm kind of going for basic start this year, because I've seen this guy kick the crap into his friends. So I don't know what he's going to do to me. Uh, I'll try I'll try and go for a sort of flip, and then we'll see how it goes. I got my elbow nice. Oh, I'm going airborne. All right. This is going bad. Uh, all right. Just do the usual strategy of contract everything and pray it works. Um, this is not... Oh, oh, sh oh, fuck me. Oh, no, I needed that. I really needed that. Damn it. I wish I could remember how to do Tori emotes. No, oh, I needed that. Should type this. Shouldn't be typing. Shouldn't be typing. Shouldn't be typing, Jack. Not a good time to type. I was committed to the bad idea, though, so I continue to type. Uh, oh no, 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 no! Damn it! Oh wow! Dad, 
Fun it was, but there goes my leg. Ah, well, it's not, it's not surprising. I'm horrible at this game at the best of times, and being ill and tired and making excuses is, uh, it's always going to be fun. Right, we'll stay for a couple more rounds with these guys because, uh, uh, fans of the show, etc. Normally I'd have quit by now, but, you know, I'm kind of enjoying myself. And, uh, seeing as there wasn't really anything to learn this week, I might as well try and put out a little bit more content. Although this episode probably will be going up late because of that. I mean, I can't see, but it looks like the episode's been going for about ten minutes so far. No idea how long I'm going to keep this going for. So, again, I'm having trouble keeping track of who's who should look at the ghosts. So, Cyronix is choking his friend now. This dude's a scary dude. Would not piss him off in the comments if I were you. Uh, right, so, what I'm going to do now, uh, ladies and gentlemen, is I'm going to learn from my mistakes, not be an idiot, and learn that uh, the past three rounds, Cyron uh, Cyronix has gone for... Cyronix has gone for a lift. So I'm going to go low at the start of the round, and then attempt to dodge his lift... And lift him. I'm not. That does not mean I'm going to shovel. I wouldn't shovel anybody, especially not a fan. But all right, let's um, let's see if we can use our brains here, as is the only way to win in Tari Bash, and actually learn something from mistakes. Streak of three. Let's see if we can do something about that. All right. I need to. I need to get low because he lifts. So if I just don't contract anything, first round drop to the floor and then spring up, I might be able to dodge his grabs. Now this is gonna look really stupid. We no, that's not gonna work. And low, low, and keep my legs contracted. Hopefully he won't get the lift in time. If I... I might be able to dodge his grab. There we go. All right, here we go. This is uh, actually kind of more what I was going for here. Um, all right. And... All right, let's see if we can get a lift. We'll see if we can get a nice lift going. Because uh, his, right, his right hand has missed me. I think I'm, I might actually be in an advantage here for a t lift and turn. Uh, let's see. This this would be the, the only time in my life I've ever learned from my mistakes. Um, right, if I go if I go for a lift, I'm pretty sure he's probably going to reverse it on me. I'm just kind of happy I was able to dodge the uh, initial grab. But he is airborne now, therefore at a disadvantage. But I I've seen people pull out. I've seen people worse than him pull out of stuff like this. So who knows? He might be able to do it. Who knows? Uh, I'm trying to throw my weight to spin him now because I imagine he's probably going to try and do the same. Okay, could be any man's game at this point. Um, if I lower my hands, I might be able to sort of pile drive him into the floor. There we are. I think I might have actually done this. Uh, oh, yes. There we go. Good good game. Very good game. That was uh, well thought. And I'm kind of... Uh, I am kind of happy I called that. All right. So, I mean, I did actually get that submitted as a tip. So I, I am actually going to say a tip of the week now. It is sometimes beneficial to not press anything at the start of your at the start of your round. It's very good for countering. Um, somebody suggested that I think maybe in a comment, and I kind of overlooked it because I thought, eh, that can't be true." But I don't know. It actually does seem to be. Um, it, well, I, I think if I, if anything's going to prove that that's true, that will. But yeah, definitely good game. Um, all right, let's try and go for a leg sweep and then pile him into the floor. Uh, right, extend elbows, grab with that hand. Lower, and I need to get some purchase or I'm going to fall. Uh, Alright. Um, oh, sh shoot on crap, Red. I threw complete... My I got cocky. I threw myself off balance. Um, right, my only hope now is to run out of time while panicking and get absolutely piled into the floor. Uh, maybe if I can get my leg back around. Um, oh, is my... What arm is that? I can't tell. Uh, shit... Shit, shit, shit. Uh, it's that arm. It's that arm. I saw it. No! Ah. Uh, damn it. Damn it. All right. I think we're going to wrap it up there. Right. There we are. Said good game and left the game. So that was the show. Please let me know in the comments where you want me to go with Tari Bash Tips, and I will take everything into consideration. Um, so, uh, lost terrain of thought where I was going there. There's links to all kinds of cool stuff in the descriptions, and not the descriptions, the one description, singular, mind blown, ill jack, tired, bed over there, want to go to there. Please subscribe, like, comment, and favorite. I'll be back next week, hopefully better energy, higher energy, not as ill, and I can bring you guys the show that you want to see. Let me know in the comments. I'm Jack Morris. Goodbye, you guys. Fun times.